Hey guys and welcome to another episode of Short Film Saturday. I hope everyone is going perfectly fine and having an absolute lovely day. On today's episode of Short Film Saturday we will be talking about a short film called Windscreens The Australian Dream. As I mentioned before, I'll be reviewing a short film called Windscreens, The Australian Dream. It follows a guy called Ronnie who believes he is living the Australian dream, where he is washing car windscreens at his local homemade set of traffic lights. During the course of the short film, he has another person called Michael trying to overtake him at this set of traffic lights as well as having a seedy businessman who owns the local car wash to get Rodney to work for him. And Rodney doesn't really want to work at the car wash but the seedy businessman does because he thinks Rodney will be wasting his talents doing it at his own set of traffic lights. The film is definitely comedic and it does provide some laughters throughout the film, through some of the dialogue that Rodney has and some of the actions and overall I thought it was really funny with the way it was done. The guy who played Rodney, um, he did a very good job with playing Rodney. Fadi, who played Michael, the guy trying to take Rodney's spot at the traffic lights, was very good as well with his acting and changes of voice with some of the dialogue early in the film. It was just very funny. Yeah, I've, been, I've been a practice. I bet you have. Is that the, uh, the White Pro 300? Uh, 350 actually. While the majority of the film is set outdoors, um, the filmmakers did a very good job with having consistent lighting throughout the film. Just it looked really good in terms of the colouring for the film and I get that when you're filming outside you're always going to be competing with the sun, clouds, rain, what have you, wind. They did a very good job with having really nice shots in that for the film. So good on to those who made the film. The costuming for the film was very well done as well and in terms of making one believe that a character is a certain way. For example, um, the guy in the balaclava, he looks like he's someone who would of course beat you up or kidnap you or something and of course he kidnaps Ronnie at one point and the way that was done was funny. Rodney, I think with in terms of his costuming, I think they were trying to make him look like a bit of a bogan in terms of who he is as a character and a person within this film. Because to me he looks like a bogan and and of course the character of Michael played by Fadi, I think they were trying to make him look like a bit of a bogan with some of his scenes in terms of taking over the car wash rather than living up to his potential or doing whatever he normally does as a job. It's never really mentioned at the end of the film when his girlfriend finds out that he's doing the windscreen wiping when he shouldn't be. The businessman owning the car wash can tell by the suit even though it's a dodgy looking suit that he's meant to be some sort of businessman. Each character has their own sense of style and it 
works really well. The camera and lighting throughout the film is really good, um, considering that they filmed a lot of the scenes outside where they wouldn't have had that much control over what the sun and the light was doing outside, but they still managed to do a really good job and the shots looked really well done. Though sometimes with night scenes when you're filming outside it can be hard to get a really nice shot but they still managed fine. The lighting in the car with the red light was really good. It looked like it was meant to be a bit of a funny scene but at the end of the day really good job with the lighting and camera work. The editing of the film was really well done. Very consistent with the pace and the audio was nicely done as well. There were no issues with it. The soundtrack and that was very well done as well. Overall I thought the film was really well done. I enjoyed the film and I'm giving it a 4 out of 5. Thank you guys for tuning in today and I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you would like me to review a short film that you'd think is worth me watching and reviewing please leave a comment below with the link to it and I'll give my best to review it and I will see you guys next time.